Hello everyone, my name's Angela and welcome to my videos. Right, today I'm going to show you an online shopping haul. I did do this two to three weeks ago and it was a click and collect. It was just before we all had to sort of stay at home. The click and collect was from Argos, Sainsbury's um, and I had to go in there to get food anyway so it was a journey that I had to do and I collected it at the same time. Okay, let's get on with this. And Oh, and the other uh, package that I got was delivered to my door. Right, so um, I looked on the website for Sainsbury's TU. And as I said before, I've always liked their prints. Some of their prints are really good. Um, so I'll show you what I bought from there. Um, and then I'll show you what I got from another package. Um, right, first of all, for ages I've liked the chinoy type sort of trousers and I've tried them on in other shops and I actually don't like the cut or the fit on them. But this one was from Sainsbury's TU and they were £16 originally and I actually got them for £8. They fit really nice, the material's really soft. And uh, for eight pound, I thought they were really worth it. It's probably cheaper than some of the other high street stores like New Look or Primark or whatever. I mean, I could be wrong because you can get them in the sales, but these were in the sales too. Now I ordered these online, and they had I think three or four colours. Um, I actually got them in this colour, which is like a dusty pink, and I actually got them in a beige, which I'm just about to show you. And I actually got them in like a yeah, like a beige type colour which I've wanted these for ages because I think there's just so much that can actually go with them um, so they were originally 16 and I got them for £8 but they're really nice fit really comfortable they've got pockets which I love um, they're button and, and flies so yeah they were really nice I actually got them both in a size 14 right okay so what else I've got in there was t-shirts Bit of a lover of printed t-shirts at the moment um, really enjoying like really funky and way out ones as well um, I haven't been to the charity shops for a while so um, normally my first port of call would be charity shops to be honest with you so yeah this is this is something I'm gonna try and get out the habit of actually buying out um, shops this was originally ten pound in Sainsbury's and everything was half price so this was I actually got this for five pound and in the actual um when you see it online when you actually see the girl trying it on online she actually has a darker colour pair of trousers on than what I tried them on with which I actually prefer I have this sort of colour skirt and trousers and I think they'd look a lot nicer like with um brown sandals or brown boots and tights because it is warming up a bit now so the sandals will be coming out soon so yeah that was got made in the west and i really like that i thought that was really different another one i got that i uh, really loved was um this one this one was originally 12 pound and i got it half price i got it for six i just quite like the print on that that was really nice and i quite like the colors with the blues and the goldy colors and the brownie colours and I think oh they're, they're really nice colours that can go together and then flowers on the outside I don't know if you can see but they're sort of like rather than transfer they're actually like embroidered so they're really pretty um yeah so they was that was a size 14 and that was six pound from 12 pounds so that was half price and the previous top that I tried on that was a 14 also this one I actually bought um, full price when I'd gone in there to do my shopping. It's a really soft, um, almost like, I can't think of the name of it. It used to be called cheesecloth years ago, but it's not called that now, I don't think. But it's a really soft, thin linen, and that was £16. And I bought that in a size 12. I don't know if you can see that, that was 16 Oh no, £16 on there. But that was a size 12 in that one. It's really thin, and I don't know if you can see the pattern, it's tiny, tiny little strawberries. Um, and that is really lovely and comfortable, and I think that looked lovely with a pair of like jean shorts in the summer. Um, yeah, really thin and lightweight and really comfortable. So that was that one. Um, another one I've got in the sale was this one. And if you can see the print on it, can you see it's all lips? 
which I think in the summer again would look lovely with jean shorts or a black pair of denim shorts or a black skirt. So that go with quite a few things or even white actually, white shorts and that. That was originally six pound. Don't know if you can see that. And I actually paid three pound for that. Um, that was a size 14 as well. Um, that's really comfortable, quite stretchy, so it's really, really comfortable. And I love the fact of the lips, it's really quirky. Really love that. Right, this was the last t-shirt I bought. Um, this was originally £10. And I actually, originally £10, and I actually paid £5 because everything was half price. But look at that with the lips on it. And it's they're like um, little rhinestone sequins. Well, not sequins, like little rhinestones on them with love. Um, really like that. Um, yeah, just like a really unusual t-shirt. Um, thought that was really nice. That was a size 14 as well. Yeah, so I thought that was really good for £5. Right, okay, so I did a ASOS order. Um, I did see this on another YouTuber. I'm fell in love with it, and I must admit, she's beautiful anyway, and to me she's beautiful and I just think she carries this dress off so well probably a lot better than what I ever could um, but I just thought it was so pretty um, as I'm loving the pastel colours um, so I had to order a dress anyway so I thought while I was on there she said where she bought this dress it was reduced in the sale and it's the make called Monkey don't know if you can see that Monkey it's a size small I did order a medium as well. Actual medium was really big on the on the material, um, like really loose fitting, very loose fitting, and it just looked like a bit like a tent on me. So um, yeah, it was really pretty, and it really looks nice on. And I know it's got long sleeves, which is not always practical for the summer, but you can like as she does. It's um, SJ Scrum. She wears them as well with tights and boots, um, which. I could wear it with tights and boots but also it's sort of it's the transitional type of stage when your arms do get a little bit cold towards the evening in the spring or even some sun, summer nights and autumn so you can wear that you know with like warmer layers or with a pair of sandals for the evening but it's really pretty I love the lilac and I love the flowers on it and the neck with the actual frill I think it's so flattering and so pretty um, it, at the back it does up as you can see with a tie and it has that frill going down the back as well and it's a really nice um, cotton I paid £13 for this in the sales which I thought was a really good price because you do go as I said I know I keep referring back to Primark I go in Primark now and their dresses can be £18, £20 now so when you find one like this reduced for £13 I think it's really worth it if you like it so that was that one from ASOS and as I said I did order another two and one was an evening dress and the other dress that I've, I ordered I didn't like it sent back so I would have had more to show you but I hadn't, haven't. <laughs> so um, yeah that was the only one I kept from that one. So that was just a little bit of online shopping and as I said when things are back to normal and it might be a while um, I'm going to steer away from doing this and steer more towards the charity shops which sustainable living is what I want to aim towards and I'm making really slow changes towards that um, but really love the the bits that I bought and you know they're some of the type of things that I'm really being careful what I think about and that I'm going to wear them over and over and over again now so um, yeah I hope that was a bit helpful and I hope that cheered you up on a on a time where we're all indoors at the moment and we're able to watch things and do things and get more creative um, so hopefully I'll bring you some more of those type of videos as well too. And I hope you're all well and stay safe. And um, if you like it, please subscribe and give it a thumbs up and leave a comment. And um, yeah, thank you. Bye.